I've got no idea how useful this feature actually is because I haven't used it on any client websites yet. But I have seen it used a few times by people in, you know, in the Squarespace community. And it, it does look cool. But anyway, I'm assuming that, you know, you've seen it and you want to know how to do it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to pin a block using Squarespace's new feature. So all you need to do is go into edit on whatever page that you're looking to pin something on. And then you can look for whatever block it is that you're going to pin. So for this one, I'm going to pin, let's go for this image here. So I'm going to click on it. You click on whatever block you want to pin, click on the pin icon, and then you can choose what the offset is. Like, so this is just basically where it starts from. So I'm going to reset that to, let me take that off. I'm going to reset it to what it was. So zero and to the top. Once I'm happy with that, I can trial it with this. So once I scroll, we can see the pin in action. So when you scroll, you see it stops. And whilst everything else moves, our pinned block stays in place. Now, I mean, it's cool. Don't know how useful it is, but that is how you do it regardless. So if you found that useful, please make sure to leave a like and hit subscribe. And if you want me to build your Squarespace website, you can get in touch using the links in the description.